So for today's video, I wanted to share with you what's in my Chanel 19 handbag. Started. If you are new to my channel, welcome. My name is Antoinette. I post new videos every Fridays and some Tuesdays regarding luxury, lifestyle, beauty, fashion, and travel. And if you like that kind of content, if you would consider subscribing to my channel and click that notification bell so you won't miss any new videos I post every week. And if you're a returning subscriber, Thank you so much for all your support. Thank you so much for watching this video. And also, you could follow me on Instagram at Always Antoinette. We could communicate and interact there as well. So now let's get started. So Chanel recently had a Chanel 19 campaign. And as you can see, I'll show you a little clip here. So I see that they feature a lot of gorgeous tweeds in this campaign, which I find amazing. And a lot of ladies are really looking into these bags right now. And a little bit of history of Chanel 19. It is called Chanel 19 because it was introduced in 2019 in their fall winter act. This was the last design of Karl Lagerfeld. And so since then, it had been a favorite. A lot of Chanel lovers wanted to add this Chanel 19 in their collection and got one of this beauty and I have the Chanel 19 which is the small and the way you can tell with the small is that the quilt it has one full quilt here and on each side it has a half quilt for the small so I got this um, 20s um, 19 in black and it is a goat skin I have a detailed review and unboxing of this Chanel 19 on one of my video if you want to check it out. So I'm not really going to detail about this um, bag. I'm just going to go over as far as what fits. I've had this bag um, maybe a few months and I've, I did carry this bag and it's been like my favorite so far because it's very versatile. Um, it's lightweight and you could really fit a lot in this bag. I know Chanel 19 comes in either goat skin, if you want the leather, it comes in goat skin and lamb skin. Mine is in goat skin and I believe the lamb skin is a little bit more supple than the goat skin but I, I heard the, the goat skin are a bit more durable than the lamb skin but the lambskin just felt a little bit more um, luxurious and supple than the goat skin. And what I love about this bag, it's its versatility and the, um, the CC here is in gold and it has the different kind of metals around it. Um, here, as you can see, and it has on the back here, it has the magnetic closure yeah so this is how it is and you really you could dress it up or down because i love the size i think the perfect size is the small and i'll show you what fits in this bag this bag does fit a whole lot and what i like in the small is that it only doesn't fit a lot but if you could wear a cute dress and still not have such a big bag on you so you could carry it you know top handle you could do it cross body and also you could do it in your shoulder so yeah so um i'll show you the inside so what i have is here it has of course the red um, fabric um inside and i have it has a zipper here and this is where i keep the card and mine is a uh, 29 series and I just keep it inside there because I don't want to lose it and um, it's the um, turn lock closure so now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to show you what fits in my bag and I'm gonna put a few um, stuff inside and I'm also gonna show you if I use an organizer I do have an organizer for this for this bag and but i'll show you what fits right now 
Here is my bag over here. And again, this is the small 19. And I will try to fit everything here. This one here is my pandemic um, kit. So what I have in here, I do have a lot in here. I have a lotion. I have, this is like uh, the wipes that you clean your table and stuff. Um, I just refill my Lysol stuff in here. I have some gum um, and I have an extra mask just in case my mask would go bad and I have some hand sanitizer of course I have a lip balm and some Dramamine or medicine if somebody gets nauseated and some pens so this is like my emergency kit bag And really, this is the only key that I carry. It's because my house, um, it's keyless entry and my car is also a keyless. And here is the key clay. And I just have a few cards in here. And I also have my Chanel um, card holder, which has the cards and coins inside and my driver's license. And of course, I have my Louis Vuitton mini pochette and um, I just have like a few items here it's like beauty stuff like makeup I have tissues I have some lipstick also here and so yeah so I will try to put all of these inside this um, Chanel 19 and I'll also put my phone so now I'm going to first do it without a um, an organizer so you guys can see. So we'll go ahead and start. And, um, and what I like about this bag is you could really stretch it out. So first, I'll put my pandemic kit. And the reason why I don't use like a, a Louis Vuitton or anything like that on this one because of the hand sanitizer. And it is like plastic lining on the inside and I really in case it leaks or something that it won't ruin that. So my bag with all the hand organizer, I mean a hand sanitizer is usually in this um, cosmetic, regular cosmetic bags. Now I'm gonna put my um, mini pochette inside and it fits perfectly and still got a lot of space inside. And now I'm gonna put my key clay in here and I'll fit it on the side right here. And my uh, Chanel card holder. And it will fit perfectly on the side. Let me see here. And as you can see, you could still close it. It still pretty much really has a lot of space. And you could nicely close this one perfectly. And also, if you also want, you could also put your phone Again, this is an iPhone 10 and I could, and my daughter likes to put little stickers on the back. And so you could put it here on the back. But with an iPhone 10, you can't really close the magnetic on the back here because um, it's a little big for that. So you can fit, but you can't close the magnetic um, closure. Here it is filled with stuff. And it's not really puffy, though it has a little weight, but it's not as heavy. And I know the medium, I heard that if you put a lot of stuff in it, then it gets pretty heavy. And the lotion is not in. So I'll put it in my um, emergency pandemic kit. So I'll put it right there. Okay, so now I'm gonna add a few more items in this bag and I'm gonna put my sunglasses here I don't think the case because it's a hard case I don't think it would fit so I'm gonna add the sunglasses inside and I could find like maybe a cloth case for the sunglasses so it won't get scratched I would advise to do that but and I found this is one of my essentials and I think it's real cute, is a little brush, hairbrush from Denman. 
that. So I put that one in there and I'll show you that this bag can still perfectly close and it doesn't ruin its shape as you can see here. So yeah, so I true this is the reason why I truly love the 19 bags because it's very versatile and you can carry a whole lot. Here it is without the organizer and I'm going to take out the contents and use the organizer here. And I believe my organizer here is from Zumini and I chose the red one because the interior of this 19 is also um, red. So I'm going to take out all the contents. it fits and I'll put it right there so really and truly it's real tight and it's nice and all that it's able to be inside the organizer and I may be able to put like my wallet up there but really I can't Put that one there as it will stretch too much so um, and that's the reason why with the 19 and really you could just put that one there and it's even kind of real real puffy right now the organizer I'm only able to put the other SLG but I'm not able to put the, the card holder the sunglasses and my cute brush. So yeah, so, you know, with, with the 19, small 19, I really do not recommend the Sumini. Maybe if you get the bigger 19, the, the medium, then, um, you know, the, oh, so it's really hard to pull now. So yeah, so for the medium, um, you may want to use an organizer because I, I think the medium can get slouchy so the the organizer is a must on the medium 19 but this is how it is empty and um, again if you're into a structured bag maybe this is not for you but if you love to get in a 19 um, and you don't want a slouchy bag then you want to get it in a small size that's in my bag for my Chanel 19 in small size and I hope that you enjoy this video and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that notification bell thank you so much for watching and have a safe day guys and I'll see you soon